Hi there, it's William from X Solutions, and today we're going to be going through the TiVo Tornado unboxing. So I have the TiVo Tornado here with me right now, and I'll open it up for you. So these are the uh, new printers that are coming to Mech eStore, so you can actually purchase them on our website now. So, uh, as you can see, that's what the... Um, Package is going to look like a lot of black styrofoam, which is always a good sign. That means everything's well packed. And you can see the, the user manual right here. So here we have central console. Test filament. Some extra pieces and extra set uh, to set everything up for you. Now these are very important because this is what you're going to be using to level your bed at a later time. Then we have the core frame. And then finally we have the actual build plate. Now you'll notice what TiVo's done is they've kept a test um, print on the plate. And what that is, is that's their guarantee that the bed's level. Because as you can see, if it can print that like that already, then the bed is level. There's, there's no bubbles or anything causing uh, that would cause you trouble. So as you can see, that is what the tornado looks like. And you can keep this on for now but you'll notice that you do need to actually undo these zip ties that are on the uh, plate. Um, just take them off with a pair of scissors or if you want, you can untie them yourself. Once you've taken off the zip ties, you can see that this will come off. That's just extra padding to make sure that the bed is safe. If you look back, you can actually see what's heating the plate. Uh, this is a lot of insulation. That's Fantastic. Um, this will really help get the bed hot and you don't have to worry about any of that burning smell. It's excellent, excellent material. So as you can see, these two power cables right here, and this is quite easy uh, and you can't really make a mistake because each one matches up with the other. So you'll see that there's four holes in this and that has to go there. And when I grab the um, frame, the other cable has uh, that number of holes and it, so they have to go together uh, when it comes to the actual cabling. So as you can see, these cables are clearly labeled. Uh, so especially if you're starting out, you're not gonna make a lot of mistakes with this one. Next, I'm gonna grab the frame and you can see that right here. And as I was talking about beforehand, you can see that this is actually sheet metal. Uh, a lot of companies do use uh, the actual printed plastics for some of these components, but this is, again, this is all metal here. We're going to move on to the fan. And as you can see, if you've ever used a CR-10S, it looks quite familiar. Uh, it's the same core design. So it's important to note that a lot of uh, the TiVos generally don't come with filament, uh, but when you do purchase through Mech Solutions and Mech eStore, uh, you will get a 200 grams of PLA wipe from CC Tree. Uh, just to help as a test print and to see if you like. Um, and of course, if you do like CC tree filament, please go to mechistore.com. Uh, we have pretty much every color available and we can ship uh, Canada wide. So we're going to uh, assemble the printer and then I'm gonna share some tips and tricks for how to best get your TiVo Tornado up and running. Um, and of course, one of the tips that I like to always lead with is when you're putting the easiest way to get the hotbed uh, hot plate in place is to put this screw in first in between the uh, bed and the actual uh, printing plate and then thread the uh, screw in between uh, uh, both of them through the uh, 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 this guy right here, and then all you have to do is put the end cap on. The second thing you have to worry about when uh, building the TiVo Tornado is cable management. The third tip that I would always provide is always, always check the screws, even the pre-assembled ones, for their tightness. Uh, because every now and again something can come loose during shipping, and it, it is possible. So if you're looking for a filament holder, uh, we will provide a link down below. Uh, of course, the beauty of a 3D printer is that you can simply print what you need. Uh, and that'll definitely help you out, making sure that your extrusion elements work perfectly with a level uh, with a spool that's up in the air. Now, the TiVo Tornado is the most 
uh, economical option for a uh, build plate of this size. Um, simply put, you'll owe, this is the best you can buy uh, for the amount of uh, printing surface that you're going to get and it is most certainly available at Mech eStore.